Good evening, people. How are you tonight? Hello. Good evening. Good evening, Myra. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Olga. Okay, people. Bienvenidos una vez más. Vamos a iniciar esta noche. Verdad. Estamos a media semana. Recuerden que el viernes hay que entregar el, uh, todas las tareas de la unidad 2 y el midterm exam, el examen de medio curso. Hay que entregarlo este viernes. Ok, así es que, pero ya vayan avanzando para que no se les acumule el trabajo. Así es que vamos a comenzar esta noche. Bueno, vamos a tomar la asistencia. Y que listos con sus cámaras y a decir present. Ok. Here we go. Miguel Ángel Domínguez. Present. Present teacher. Ok. Good evening, Miguel. Thank you. Olga Marleni Gómez. Present teacher. Perfect. Good evening, Olga. Good evening, teacher. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Najet. Senaida America Dominguez. Najet. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Hilda Xiomara. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Present teacher. 
Yes, welcome. Thanks, teacher. Ana Delmi Herrera. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Linda Stephanie Ramírez. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Present. Okay. Nelson Iván Alfaro. Present. Okay. Carla Verónica Suria. Present, teacher. Good. Present. Ángel Alexander Guardado. Present, teacher. Okay. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Irma, todavía no. Mayra Roxana Hernández. Present. Ok. Carlos Alberto Meléndez. Todavía no. Carolina Yamilet Hernández. Good evening, teacher present. Good evening. Thank you. Silvia Suleima Rodríguez. Present, teacher. Okay, very good. Silvio Enrique Cortez. Present. Okay, welcome. Joana Beatriz Orellana. No. Ok. ¿Quiénes llegaron ya? Senaida ah, ya llegó. Yes, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Claudia is here. Alejandra. Linda. Irma. Carlos. Joanna. Not yet. Okay, let's get started with you. Uh, last night, I asked you to write about your activities and the frequency of your activities at work. Okay, how often do you do what you do? So, uh, for example, um, about my job, I always uh, I always study the lesson before the class. That's me. I uh, sometimes uh, prepare some extra material for the class. No, not sometimes. I usually prepare some extra material for the class. Um, what else? In my job as an interpreter, I... Um, Seldom ask permission. Rarely ask permission. 
So, what else I do? Well, I always have my glass of water uh, during the class or during my my job as an interpreter. Yeah, I need water. Um, so those are some of my activities and the frequency I do my activities. Um, something that I never do. I never go out for work. I never go out for work. I'm working from home. Or I never go out for work. Okay, so that's me. Those are my activities, some of my activities and the frequency I do my activities. Okay. Any volunteer to talk about the frequency of his or her activities? Me, teacher. Okay, Senaida, go ahead. We hear you. For example, I uh, always uh, take the coffee in the morning, drink coffee. Uh, I always take a shower. <laughs> okay. And uh, I usually I don't, I don't remember. I usually I usually around late the work. Usually. Yes, but uh, <laughs> it's for the change the schedule. Ah, okay, okay. For example, uh, Sunday and Saturday, I around two thirty o'clock p.m. Okay. All the week. Weekend. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and uh, uh, I usually watch TV. Mm -hmm. And Hardly ever play soccer. Okay, very good. Thank you, Zenaida. Pass the ball to another classmate, to another participant, Zenaida. Carolina? Okay. Okay. Um, we all go always confirm the agent one day before the consultation. Uh, we rarely lost serial patients. We hardly hardly ever see work inks. Uh, my boss seldom sees older adult patients. Sometimes we have had problems Come problems parents uh, and we never disrespect our patients. Ah, okay, very good. Okay, thank you, Caroline. How's the ball, Caroline? Pardon? How's the ball? How's the ball? Pass. As the ball. Ah, okay. Veamos. Um, Silvio. Okay. Okay. I don't, I don't finish, but I I use someone. I always use the mask when I go out. 
I sometimes eat fish on weekends. Mm -hmm. I uh, hardly ever is, uh, use the, the bike. I, I never uh, uh, drink a beer. Okay. Uh, only. Two, two or more, not two one. More. <laughs> <laughs> only one. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Pass the ball, Silvio. Okay. Um... Oh. Olga? Okay, Olga. Is the next. Olga, where did you go? Olga is not in there in the room. Okay. Um, to someone else, please. Sylvia. Okay, Sylvia. You see, that happens when you turn off the cameras, huh? There I, is... always, <laughs> I always start off job at 7.30 a.m. Okay. And I usually go to Santa Ana. And normally in the morning, I receive calls of personal of security. And uh -huh. I, I always take my lunch at 1 p.m. Mm, only. <laughs> okay. What is something that you never do? Silvia. Mm, I never go to San Miguel. Ah, okay. Okay, good. I went to San Miguel this weekend. I went for my uh, niece, nephews. For my nephew's wedding. It was very good. Okay, Silvia, pass the ball, please. Um, Alejandra? Alejandra is not in the room. Uh, Ana Delmi? Not in the class yet. Carlos? Not in the class. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Irma? Irma is working. Um, Miguel Angel. Miguel Angel. Okay, let's see. Hi, good evening. Good evening, Miguel. Uh, uh, yo hice algo sencillo, teacher. Uh, como, okay, no problem. Uh, uh, I am often late for work. Oh, oh, Always, oh. always tell uh, me to arrive early <laughs> uh, I, rarely, I rarely change shoes okay and yet I am happy <laughs> however never falling okay be careful getting late to work be careful they're going to fire you Okay, good. Uh, pass the ball, Miguel. Uh, Angel. Angel. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Angel. No. Uh, I usually uh, work in go in, in my work. <laughs> eh, uh -huh. eh, 
Reality is, is played one day in weekend basketball. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> Tell me something that you never do. I I never fool uh, dinner in my house. You never eat dinner in your house? Uh, never, casi nunca. <laughs> Ah, hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Rarely. Oh, okay. dinner. Dinner. Okay. So, where do you where do you eat dinner? In the street or in my work. At work. Okay. At work. Good. Okay. Thank you, Angel. Pass the ball. Welcome. Uh, one moment. Uh, Nelson. Nelson Ivan Alfaro. Okay, Nelson. What about you? Okay. Um, always take a break at night uh, 15 a.m. Mm -hmm. Usually have a meeting on week. Normal, normally check my email. Mm -hmm. Dimos un rato, no, no te escuchamos. Okay. Never mm -hmm. fighting my work. Ah, okay. That's good. And hardly ever take a breakfast. Oh, that is not good. Anything else? It's bad. <laughs> yeah. That is not good. They say that breakfast that is. is the most important meal in the day. Okay, very good, Nelson. Pass the ball then. Pass the ball, Nelson. Nelson, pass the ball. Okay. Mm. Carlos Alberto. Okay, welcome, Carlos. Good evening. Uh, good evening. We are talking about the, the activities and the frequency of the activities you do at work or or in a day, in a typical day? Mm, on Saturday, I never have a meeting on Saturday. Ah, okay. Um, I'll we uh, make uh, sales reports all days. Okay. <laughs> something you do sometimes um, um sometimes um, I negotiate business uh, with uh, um, proveedores no sé cómo se dice suppliers right Su suppliers suppliers and uh, sometimes um, I business uh, with surprise. You make or business. Send, send, uh, material uh, in Central America. Ah, okay. Okay, very good. Thank you. Pass the ball, Carlos. Um, Carla Veronica. Okay, Carla. Okay, Chen. Um, I always answer the telephone 
I never use the uniform in the work. I sometimes drink coffee in the afternoon. I rarely at work of weekend. I I always have lunch at noon. Mm. I normally arrive at work at 6 50 a.m. Oh, very early. Okay, very good. Thank you, Carla. Pass the ball, please. Um, we Zenaida? have. Zenaida. Zenaida is done. Yeah, ya lo hizo. We have Xiomara, Mayra, Marisol, and Olga. Hola, Marisol. Okay, Marisol. Okay, teacher. I always check the email. I rarely um, eat breakfast at work. I hardly ever um, I hardly ever I have a mistake. Oh. And I seldom drink coffee at work. Mm. I sometimes um, I sometimes finish work early. And I never get late at work. Oh, okay. Very good. When you talk about mistakes, it's better to say make. Make. I never make, make a mistake. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I never make a mistake. Okay. Yes. I'm perfect. Okay. <laughs> I need to, <laughs> to be <laughs> perfect. Okay, yeah. Because the reservation is very important to be responsible. Yes, okay, must be accurate. Yeah. yeah. Okay, now, pass the ball, Marisol. We have okay. uh, Xiomara, Olga, Mayra, and now Alejandra. Mayra. Okay, Mayra. Tell us about the, your activities at work or in your day and the frequency you do those okay. things. Okay. Um, I always wake up at the 4.30 a.m. Wow. Yeah. Um, I go out to my work at 5 a.m. And I, I always um, class in the morning at 6 a.m. Uh, Monday to Friday. And I always start my work at 7 a.m. And I usually have a meeting. Um, in the morning, um, I never practice exercise in the weekend. Um, I sometimes um, came, I don't know if, if, if came is correct, but I use, I, I never came the, the mall in the Sunday. You never Come. Come, ah, okay. Yeah, yes. with, especially with these uh, frequency adverbs, we always use, we usually use a, a simple present. Okay. And mm -hmm. um, I never wake up early in, in the weekend. Okay. Very good. Good for you. Okay. And. Who's next, Myra? Who's next? Olga, Xiomara, 
or uh, 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 uh. Olga, teacher. Olga, are you there, Olga? Yes, teacher. Okay. I'm you. <laughs> I will seek my daughter. Your daughter. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I hope she gets better. Thank you. Okay. Uh, I usually wake up early around the 5 a.m. And I go to my work around the 6 and 6.30 a.m. I Every day I drive to my work and usually I arrive at my work around the 7.30 or 7.45. Uh, occasionally, I, I arrive to 8.14 when, uh, when the traffic is very heavy. Mm -hmm. Because uh, in my in my work and um, entienden eso, I understand me. Okay. Uh, in my work, I am very desk. Uh, usually, I I have a lunch at twelve to one p.m. In the afternoon, uh, occasionally I draw, I drink coffee uh, around the three p.m. and I and I get out my house at five thirty p.m. Sometimes okay. I get I get out. 5 p.m. but is readily and I arrive to my home around the 7 or 7.30 p.m. and at the 8 p.m. I have the English class. Okay. Perfect, very good. Thank you, Olga. Uh, pass the ball, Olga. We have Xiomara or Vanessa. Xiomara. Okay, Xiomara. I always organize the agenda with my boss. I rarely arrive late for my work. Um, I hardly ever speak with my colleagues about the, my life, my personal life. Mm -hmm. I seldom listen music in my job. Um, sometimes go to eat with my colleagues. And I never stop thanking God for his blessing. Okay, very good. Very important okay and finally uh, Vanessa Alejandra Vanessa okay teacher eh, bueno no sé realmente qué es qué fue la tarea pero creo que es hablar acerca de mis actividades sí yes and the frequency okay. of your activity uh, okay I uh, usually wait wake up at 6 I am to have breakfast and um, okay. I have I have rotating rotativo um, ¿Cómo se pronuncia teacher? Mm, rotative oh. okay. I have rotating uh, schedules horarios rotativos schedules schedules es okay schedule and from Monday to Friday, I have opening hours for class for classes. I um, I enter my work hours from eight a.m. in the morning 
to 4 p.m. or 5 p.m. in the afternoon. Um, finish. <laughs> okay. I was checking here and is hmm, rotating. Uh, it's ro rotate. rotating, but I'm not sure if that is the rotating. Okay. Okay, and turno. Turnos is a shift in este caso. Ah, Hablamos okay. de turnos, ¿verdad? El turno de la mañana, the morning shift, el turno de la tarde, the eh, afternoon shift. Pero para decir horarios, por lo menos horarios, horarios es, rotativos. Ajá, horarios. Ajá, es que, ¿qué okay, es? Schedule, yes. Okay, very good, very good. No one is missing. I don't think so. Perfect. So we, uh, well, I, I have some questions for you using the, the frequency adverbs. Let me show you to practice a little bit more this, okay? Not this, I want you to see this. Look at these questions, okay? Simple questions. How often do you speak English? Uh, how often do you surf the net? How often do you listen to music? How often do you swim? How often do you play video games? How often do you eat pizza? How often do you study? How often do you watch a movie? How often do you use the computer? Observe that the questions, so when you want to ask for frequency, the question is how often? How often? You can hear the pronunciation of this like often, or often, how often, okay? How often do you speak English? Or how often do you speak English? So that is the question for frequency, all right? So I will send you to work in, in pairs or in groups, uh, maybe three or four. And I want you to practice with these questions, okay? Ask each other these questions and give natural answers, okay? How often do you speak English? Well, I always speak English at work or I usually speak English in my English class or I never speak English because I'm afraid or whatever, okay? How often do you surf the net? So, well, I every day I always surf the net Oh, I never surf the net. Okay. How often do you listen to music? I rarely listen to music or I always listen to music when I work or whatever, okay? So in pairs or in groups, uh, you, you are going to practice with this question. All right. Let me share the the chart in WhatsApp so you can use it. In the meantime, let me form the groups. There you, there you go and join your groups, please. In practice. 
It's a speaking practice. You don't have to write. Speaking, speaking, speaking. Join your groups, please. Very good, very good. Hello. Okay, just Hello. to just to remind you that it's a speaking practice. You don't have to write. No tienen que escribir, solo hablar. Okay. So okay, practice. Teacher. Solo okay. recordarles que es speaking, speaking practice, ok? No tienen que escribir. Ah, ok. Ok. Practice, practice, practice. Always speak English. Because okay. in my work, I need to speak English with people de other countries. Oh, really? Okay. Yes. It's okay. Okay. In my, in my case, rarely, it's more listening. The teacher, the teacher sent in the, in the WhatsApp. Yes. And how often uh, they are one, two, three, four, five, six, six, six seven, eight, nine, nine questions. Yeah. Oh, in the US. It's, it's a speaking practice, okay? No tienen que escribir yes. nada. Yes, teacher. Ah, okay. okay. Practice, mm -hmm. speak, yeah. speak, speak. Okay. In, uh, in, in, uh, está en el Hello. grupo. Hello, teacher. Eh, solo que no puedo, no puedo compartir, no. Si, si me puede dar acceso, please. Okay. There you are. Okay, thank you. thank you. Solo recordarles que es una práctica speaking, no de escribir. Solo speaking. Okay. 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 Thank you, teacher. Teacher, no sé con quién voy. Good night, teacher. Claudia, le saluda. Que voy entrando. Yo tenía problema para ingresar. No le escucho, teacher. 
Perdón, estaba apagado. Eh, la voy a enviar a, a un grupo. Ok, gracias. Ok.
Tranquila. I, I always speak English in my house. Okay. How often do you surf the net? Um, always, always watching movies on the weekend. In my case, I watch the movies with my family on weekend. Hola. Ah. I hardly ever. No, I never because because a Friday. Ah, a movie. A movie. And. Uh, Okay, okay, welcome back. So, uh, do you have any question about the frequency adverbs? No questions? Clear? I have a question to share. Tengo una duda. Uh, donde dice, how often do you surf to net? ¿Qué tan a menudo frecuente la red de navegación es? Uh, the net is the internet. Surf the net se, se dice cuando uno entra al internet solo para estar pasando página a página, viendo ahí cosas, ¿no? Surfear el internet. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Any other question about the frequency adverbs? If not, we'll continue with the next lesson. It's clear, teacher. Perfect. Let's see. In this lesson, 
you will be able to read collective schedules showing basic and common tasks in a restaurant and talk about scheduled activities at your workplace. Okay. What is the estimated time an employee works a day in your workplace? Well, how many hours do people work? Do people usually work here in El Salvador per day? Eight hours. Eight hours, okay. Good. And does everybody have a specific schedule to follow? And not always, right? No. No, 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 definitely no. Okay, we have a conversation here. It's very short. Are you sure? Yes. Usual, usual. Your microphone went off, Carolina. Perdón. Eh, usually, um, is is a night uh, all tall, all, all in work, ¿eh? Usualmente son ocho horas casi en todos los trabajos, de ocho a cinco. Usually, eh, yeah. Ajá, ajá, pero no todos. Not all at the same time, yes. So. Mm -hmm. The idea is by law, you shouldn't work more than 44 hours a week. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. 44 hours a week. But, okay. Thank you. Let's take a look at this conversation between Ben and Matthew. It says, hey, Matthew, how's it going? Very good, Ben. I am relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shifts for this morning or for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kate have the evening shift. You see, this is what I was telling you about the, the los turnos, ¿verdad? Se dice shift. Okay. Well, let me read it one more time. Hey, Matthew, how's it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shifts for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay. Hmm. Give me a second, I'm checking that order. Okay, yeah, it is okay. Okay, now let's practice. Repeat after me, please. Um, Hey Matthew, how's it going? Hey Matthew, hey, Matthew how's this is going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic. No. Very good, Very good Ben. 
I am relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shifts this coming weekend? You're right. Look, who has the early and late shifts for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. According, according to the schedule, according Mark, to the schedule and Sophie, Mark, the Mark and Sophie have the morning shift and afternoon and Tom shift, and, Kate and Tom have and Kate the have the shift. evening shift. Okay, very good. Now I am Ben and you are Matthew, okay? Hey Matthew, how's it going? Very good, Very good Ben. ben. I believe I that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According, According to, to the school, Mark and Sophie, and Sophie have this morning and afternoon, and afternoon shift. shift. And, and Tom and Kate have, have the evening shift. shift. Okay, very good. Now you are Ben and I am Matthew. You begin. One, two, three. Hey, Matthew. Hey, how, Matthew how is it going? How is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. You're right. Has he been in the for this coming weekend? For this coming weekend. According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay. Okay. Very good. Uh, okay. Well, this is just a short conversation to practice. So I'll send you to work in pairs just to practice this short conversation. Okay. Three. Oh, I'm going to take the, the second attendance before sending you to your groups. Okay, please respond. Miguel Angel Dominguez. Okay. Olga Marleni Gomez. Present teacher. Okay. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Present teacher. Good. Tenaida America Dominguez. Present teacher. Okay. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Present teacher. Good. Ana Delmi Herrera. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Present teacher. Okay. Linda Stephanie Ramirez. Present teacher. Okay. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Present. Good. Nelson Iván Alfaro. Present teacher. Good. Carla Verónica Suria. Present teacher. Good. Ángel Alexander Guardado. Present teacher. Okay. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Present teacher. Okay. Mayra Roxana Hernandez. Present teacher. Good. Um, Carlos Alberto Melendez. Present. Okay. Carolina Yamilet Hernandez. Present teacher. Good. Silvia Suleima Rodriguez. Present teacher. Okay. Silvio Enrique Cortez. Present. 
Okay, and Joanna Beatriz Orellana. Teacher Veronica is uh, saying the group that problem with her in interview. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, let me see some. Okay. Okay, tonight the personal session is with Linda um, Stephanie, okay? Just to remind you that. Okay, Linda. Okay or no, okay. Uh, no. Okay, go to your groups, practice the conversation is very short, so I will give you only five minutes, okay?
Okay, very good. Please, um, Ana Marisol and Mayra, present the conversation. Okay, teacher. Can you share the okay. that? Okay. Thank you. There it is. Okay, I'm Ben. Okay. Hey, hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kay have the evening shift. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now, please, Claudia and Senaida. Okay, Senaida. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I am relieved that everybody is here today because of traffic, you know. You're right. Look, how who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the student, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay, very good. Carlos and Carla. Okay. Carlos? Yes. You start. Okay, Ben. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I am relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic to you know. You are right. And look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kay have the evening shift. Perfect, thank you. Uh, Nelson and Silvio. Okay. okay. Hey, Matthew, who is this going? Very good, Ben. I really that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shifts for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Perfect. Angel and Sylvia. Okay, I mean, bang, Sylvia. Okay, hey, Matthew. Excuse me? No, oh, siga, siga. <laughs> hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I am relieved that every ball it is today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for the coming weekend? According to the school, 
Mark and Sophie have the coming and afternoon shift and Tom and Kay have the everyday shift. Perfect, thank you. And Irma and Miguel Angel, can you? Irma not appear. Oh, Irma is okay, okay, okay. Okay, I am Ben and you are Matthew, Miguel. Okay. What? Hey Matthew, how's it going? Very good, Ben. I believe that everybody is here today because of the traffic. You know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the school, Mark and Sophie have the morning after shift. And so in case, how the evening shift. Okay, very good. Now, uh, Alejandra and Linda. Okay. Okay. Mm, hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? Weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kate have the evening shit. Okay, very good. And finally, Caroline and Xiomara. Okay. Um, Xiomara? Yes, I'm Ben or Matthew? Uh, ben. Okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I believe that everybody is here today because the traffic you know. You're right. Look who has the early, late, and late shift for this coming weekend. According to the schedule, uh, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kay have the evening shift. Okay, very good. Just a few words. Uh, what we're going to do is this, yes. Okay. Um This one, la mayoría la dijo muy bien, es relieved, relieved. Okay, and what is the meaning of relieved? Aliviado. Aliviado, ¿verdad? Me siento aliviado, estoy aliviado, eh, eh, pero sobre todo de, de, de tranquilo, que se ha quitado un peso de encima, ¿no? Okay. Um, bueno, esta sigue dándonos problema. Oops. Schedule. Schedule. Es la pronunciación de esta palabrita. Schedule. Okay. Esta es early. Early. And basically, okay, very good. Well, uh, look at this. this is the schedule for um, this uh, company? Okay. Uh, I think this is a restaurant. 
because of the uh, of the positions. We have a cashier. Cashiers are Kimberly Thompson, Cynthia Leal, Pamela Dries, and Karen Wilkins. They are the cashiers. The cooks are Kevin Dooley, Mateo Luz, and Linda Harris. The manager, Jennifer Rodriguez. The order takers are Jorge Milano, Mario Milano, Carlos Guardian, and Gustavo Wandique. And waiters are Walter Omo, Ailey Duque, Matthew Toole, and Oscar Sagrario. These are the different positions. And you have the times, okay? 11 or 10 a.m., 11 a.m., 12, 1 p.m., 2 p.m., 3 p.m., 4 p.m., 5 p.m., 6 p.m., 7 p.m., 8 p.m., 9 p.m., 10 p.m. So, if I ask you this question, the first question is, who manages the restaurant? What is the answer? Um, Jennifer. Jennifer Rodriguez. Jennifer Rodriguez, correct. Who cooks? Kevin Dooley, Karen Dooley, Dooley Mateo you know, Luz, Mateo Linda Luz, Harris. Linda Harris and Karen Dooley. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Now you have five questions about the this schedule. Okay. Please take five minutes and respond these five questions. Who is in charge of waiting tables in the morning shift? Who is in charge of managing the restaurant? Who is in charge of the kitchen in the morning shift? Who is in charge of taking orders during the morning shift? And what does Matthew do? Okay, just to practice, I want you to give complete answers, okay? So, fulano de tal is in charge of waiting the tables in the morning shift. Fulano de tal is in charge of managing the restaurant. Just to practice complete answers, please. All right. I'll give you five minutes to respond to questions. Remember, when you finish, raise your hand.
Okay, now I'll give you time to compare your answers with uh, some classmates, okay? I'll give you five minutes to compare your answers. You can ask the question and the other respond. Okay, una pregunta y los otros responden. Join your groups, please, and practice.
teacher, we need more time. <laughs> oh, really? Okay, you will have more time, but now, um, let's practice here. Let me ask you. Let me share the screen. Okay, according to the schedule, who is in charge of waiting tables in the morning shift? For me, teacher, Walter Omo and Matthew, Matthew Tool is in share the restaurant. <laughs> Okay. Mm. Sí, son Walter Omo y Matthew Tool. Pero ¿cómo diríamos lo demás? Teacher. Hola. Uh, is necessary in the answer use the in. Is in o are in. Ah. Ajá. Is, is necessary. The in. Are in. Yes. In charge. Okay, in the, in the argument, in the answer, charge. Walter and Matthew are in charge of the waiting tables in the morning shift. Yes. Okay, yes. in. I, sí, I, porque estar a cargo de es in charge of. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, muy bien. Number two. Who is in charge of managing the restaurant? Jennifer. Jennifer Rodriguez. Rodriguez is in charge of managing the restaurant. Okay. okay. Good. Who is in charge of the kitchen in the morning shift? Kevin and Kevin. Karen in Do charge it. kitchen in the morning shift. Ajá, a ver, a ver, faltan algunas cositas en esta frase. Kevin and Dolly, Kevin and Karen Dolly. Are, they are, are in charge. Are in charge of the chicken. Of the chicken. chicken. No chicken. 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 In the morning chief. Okay. <laughs> Who is in charge of taking orders during the morning shift? Jorge Milano and Carlos Guardian are in shares of the taking orders during in the morning chief. Okay. Are in charge of taking orders. And what does Matthew do? Matthew makes the schedule for the employees. Matthew, Matthew is in the charge the waiter in the morning shift. Mm -hmm. Oh, Matthew is, is a waiter. Okay, Matthew is a waiter. Matthew Remember, serve, serves the food. Or is in charge to serve us the food. Okay. Oh, well, remember that this question is about occupation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What do you do? Mm -hmm. I'm a teacher. I'm an interpreter. Okay. What does Matthew do? He's a waiter. So this question is Matthew for is occupation. A waiter. Okay. It's a, waiter. it's a waiter. Occupation. It's a waiter. Okay. Now you have to write five questions. Five more questions about the schedule. Okay. Okay. Me the same. The same schedule but you have to write five more questions. It's, for example, you can ask, uh, who are the cashiers in the afternoon shift? 
just to give you an example, let me write that. Who are the cashiers in the afternoon shift? That is one example. Okay. The answer is in this case is Pamela and Karen. Pamela and Karen are the cashiers in the afternoon shift. Okay, this is an example. Pero es de información del cuadro que van a hacer las preguntas. Okay. Hola, teacher. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yo las había hecho conforme a, a creí que eran a, a ocupaciones dentro del trabajo, eh, preguntándole a otros compañeros. Mm, no, no. Luego, no. Bueno, yo aquí he puesto la respuesta, pero lo que, y pueden ustedes poner su respuesta para saber cuál es la respuesta, ¿no? Lo que vamos a hacer mañana es de acuerdo. Siempre todo es en base al cuadro, al horario que tenemos ahí. Mañana ustedes le van a hacer preguntas, estas preguntas a sus compañeros, pero sobre el cuadro. Ok. Ok. okay. Teacher. Yes. Uh, para preguntar. Como por una hora en específico sería, por ejemplo, who is in charge of taking order in the shift 5 p.m. No, no sería. No. Ese no es un shift. ¿Verdad? Shift es un turno. Si usted quiere preguntar eso, dirías who is in charge of taking orders at 5 p.m. Oh, but, okay. Yeah, who is in charge of taking orders at 7 p.m.? Ah, fulano de tal. Okay, thank you. Okay. Okay, people. I'm going to take the last attendance for tonight and tomorrow we are going to practice with your questions. Sure. Can you repeat the... the... The task, the task for the Friday of the... For Friday, yes. Mm -hmm. On, let me... On Monday, I gave you a text, an article. No, it's not an article. It's like a document. For uh, the curriculum vitae or the resume. And the last three pages are about the cover letter. In um, the United States, they used to, the, when you send your resume, it is usually, or almost always actually, you have to send a cover letter. They ask you for a cover letter. On the last three pages in that document, you can see what is a cover letter and how you can write a cover letter. Okay, what is the information that is included in a cover letter? Okay, so you read those pages and prepare your personal cover letter. That is what you are going to do. You have to prepare your cover letter and you're going to read your cover letter on Friday here. 
Okay. Okay, thanks. Everybody understood? Todos entendieron esa actividad? Yes. Va. Perfect. Okay. No, the less attendance. Okay, let's see. Please turn on your cameras and say present. Um, hoy nos toca de abajo hacia arriba, ¿no? No, igual. Joana Beatriz didn't show up tonight. Silvio Enrique Cortés. Present. Good okay, night. Okay, good night. Silvia Suleima Rodriguez. Present, teacher. Good night. Good night. Carolina Jamilet Hernández. Present, teacher. Good night. Good night. Carlos Alberto Meléndez. Present. Good, good night. night. Mayra Roxana Hernández. Present. Okay. Good night, Mayra. Good night, teacher. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Present, teacher. Okay. Have a good night. Good night, teacher. Ángel Alexander Guardado. Present, teacher. Good night. Okay. Good night. Carla Verónica Suria. Present teacher, good night. Good night. Nelson Ivan Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay, good night. Good night. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Present. Okay, good night. Good night. Linda Stephanie Ramirez. Present teacher. Okay, please don't go. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Present teacher. Okay, see you tomorrow. Good night. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Present teacher. Okay, good night, Hilda. Good night, teacher. Good night, America Dominguez. Present teacher. Okay, have a good night. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Present teacher. Okay, good night. Good night, teacher. Olga Marleni Gomez. Present teacher. Okay, good night. Yeah. And Miguel Angel Dominguez. Good night, Miguel. Okay, Linda, how can I help you? ¿Hay algo que quisiera reforzar? I cannot hear you. Sorry, teacher. <ríe> eh, sobre lo que estaban viendo ahorita, cuando son dos personas, eh, se ocupa are in charge of. Yes. Uh -huh. mm. Ok, entonces, digamos, si la pregunta es, who is in charge of taking orders? Tengo que contestar, tales personas are in charge of, eh, mm -hmm. y, y, la, y el puesto, or the taker. No, no, no. En ese caso es, <clears throat> fulano y sutano are in charge of taking orders. Ah, taking orders. Okay. Uh -huh, porque eso es lo que preguntó. Ok. Ok, y eh, un, una de las compañeras preguntó cuando es con hora. Eh, no le entendí muy bien cómo se formula la, la pregunta cuando es con hora. Ah. Oh. Por ejemplo, vemos aquí el cashier. ¿Verdad? Um, um, 
Vaya, si yo quiero preguntar quién es la cajera. ¿Verdad? ¿O quiénes son los cajeros? ¿Verdad? A tal hora. ¿O quién es la cajera a tal hora? La pregunta sería, who is the cashier at eh, 8 p.m.? ¿Cómo me respondería? 8 p.m. Who is the cashier at 8 p.m.? Pamela Driz and Karen, Karen Wilkins are the cashier to 8 p.m.? At, at 8 p.m. At 8 p.m., okay. Mm -hmm. Así sería. Okay. No, no. Okay, teacher. Okay. Uh, ¿Algo más? Eh, nada más, teacher. Only that. Okay, but entonces, a ver. Lo que vimos ayer, como porque no estuviste ayer, ¿verdad? Ah, sí, ayer no, no me pude conectar al final, teacher, porque no daba suficientes datos. Ok. Um, bueno, solo te comparto rápidamente eso que vimos ayer. A ver. Ayer vimos los adverbs of frequency o frequency adverbs, ¿verdad? Que nos sirven para determinar la frecuencia de una acción. Y son estos, ¿no? Que ya estuvimos usando ahora un poco temprano. Always, usually, normally or generally, often, frequently, sometimes. Occasionally, seldom, hardly ever, or rarely, never. ¿Ok? Ok. Y veíamos que... Eh, um, la estructura está... ¿Verdad? El adverbio... Siempre va antes del verbo principal. ¿Ok? ¿Ves? Daniel always passes his exams. El verbo es passes. Y el adverbio de frecuencia always. Y así es en todos estos casos. ¿Ve? I always study. Always study. Usually walk. Normally get often Chef. read hola ahorita estoy viendo la página del libro oh perdón perdón que pasó ok ok ahora ok sí hoy sí vaya entonces eh bueno, todos estos son los, los frecuenciados, ¿verdad? Todos estos. Que determinan la frecuencia de una actividad. Y estaba diciendo que esta es la estructura. Es decir, aquí lo importante es ver que el frequency adverb va antes del verbo. ¿Ok? Ok. Always passes, always study, usually walk, normally get, often read, sometimes sing, occasionally go, seldom put, hardly ever get, never eat. Okay? Excepto cuando estamos usando el verbo to be. ¿Ves? 
cuando es el verbo to be, es al revés, el orden. Primero va to be y después ve el adverbio. ¿Verdad? He is always happy. happy. Okay. Por ejemplo, si quiere decir yo nunca estoy tarde. I am never late. Okay. You are uh, you always are late. you are always late. <laughs> you are sometimes uh, in 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 trouble so i don't know okay entonces cuando es el verbo to be va antes okay mm -hmm. eso es lo que estuvimos viendo ahí okay. eh, bueno ahí en el whatsapp tú puedes ver les dejé algunos un par de ejercicios que los puedes hacer si quieres para repasar okay de acuerdo verdad de acuerdo. Eso es lo que estuvimos viendo ahí. Uh -huh. Digamos la, la, la primera del, del número tres sería I'm late, I'm rarely, rarely, I'm rarely late for school in the morning. Correcto. Ajá. Uh -huh. En la segunda, no sé, como no es verbo to be, sería mm -hmm. some occasionally goes out with his friend. Correcto. Ok. Ok. okay. Muy bien. Ok. Ok, teacher. Seguiré Perfect. repasando ese. Perfect, Linda. Ok. okay. See you tomorrow, Thank ok. You. Thank you. See you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.